In this video, I'm going to give you my honest review on Juice.ai. This is an SEO plus AI copywriting tools that is available on the market. It's also on AppSumo. Previously, I've got Juice.ai lifetime deal back in last year's Black Friday. And it was the it was the the minimum, the lowest plan, the lowest tier plan. And they've evolved a bit on their platform. And now they're on AppSumo. As you can see, there's only two tackles on their review. So there's not much review, but I do want to give my my own my own opinion and the way I've been using it, what I'm seeing on the platform on their Facebook group. So let's get into it. So juice.ai is is very different from the other uh, copywriting tools. So I wouldn't say this is like a comparison with Jasper because Jasper can do like long form articles, long form blog, but they can also do like short form stuff. But juice.ai does not do any like short form content. All it does is you put in a keyword and it goes through their own algorithm based on those long tail keywords and generate an article for you. So if you have seen my previous review on question generator, it's very similar to that kind of, uh, that kind of tool. So let's have a look at their platform. So this is inside the juice.ai platform. The layout is pretty simple. On the left hand side, you've got your seed words. So seed word is your your main keyword. So you want to have a C word. So let's say you want to put in any of the keywords and you hit add. I think every time you put in a new C word, it will probably take a few hours to crawl all the, all the long tail keywords for you. And then once it's done, then for example, what I have here is AI copywriter as my C tool. And then you can start to see the, these are the long tail keywords juice.ai has found. So if we click on see all, it will show you the different tiers of the, the keywords. So based on the different plans, my understanding is you might get the one for standard, but if you want the better long tail keywords, it will be the juicy tier, extra juicy and super juicy. So the more juicy it is, I believe it's, it's more likely to be ranked higher. So let's just look at the ones on standard. So like AI copywriter, the most basic word, how I become a copywriter, AI and copy, e-commerce copywriter. I would say these are like really generic key terms and it might be hard to rank for these if this keyword is already very established. But if we skip to like the extra juicy, copywriter, how to become, how much a copywriter earn, how much does a copywriter make a year? So I think this this third one is actually fine. Copy AI review. So that sort of is related with AI copywriter. And let's have a look at the super juicy. So what they say on super juicy keywords for AI copywriter keyword, it could be stuff like, uh, is copywriter a good job? How much does a copywriter make per hour? How do copywriters make money? So these are like, a slightly longer keyword. So what we can do is that we'll just hit like this one. We want to generate an article for this particular keyword. And then we can also look for how is a copywriter, a creative artist to the let to the letter. I don't really know what that means. So let's see. How much should I charge as a freelance copywriter? I think that's good. And then how long does it take to be a copywriter? So let's say we want to choose three of these keywords and turn into an article. So after selecting these three, we scroll down on the bottom left, all the way, do you see that article generator, this section? And then this is the prompt that will be sent to the generator. So if we're happy with these three titles and you can hit generate. So you can generate up to 25 articles at the same time. And depending on your subscription, uh, how many articles you can generate per month, then you can have a look at that. 
So if we're happy with that, we'll hit generate. So as you can see, it's now being generated, it's now generating your bulk generation has started. And recently they've gone through some of their own sort of algorithm change and generating their article is much, much, is so fast. I think it's, yeah, they claim to be less than 60 seconds. And I think that is true. So I believe it's already done. If I just go back to my, my root folder. Okay. It's still, it's still running right now. So let's see how long that's going to take. All right, we're finished. So this time it took around three minutes to get it generated. And let me just move this into my particular folder. I think their website is a bit laggy today. So we've got these articles here. As you can see, there are no images here because in the past I've tried use Juice AI with their block generator and the images that they choose from, I think they use Unblash or Pixabay. I don't think the, the images are too accurate. So I've just turned them off by default and I just find the right image that I want instead of like re replacing all the images. I think I've tried a lot of probably like, you no know, 20, 20, 50 articles and 80% of them are missed rather than getting the right image for me. So I just run, I just want to create or find my own images and stick into the article instead. So let's have a look at this one. How do copywriters make money? We'll click on it. So that's the, that's the layout. This is your, your long form, uh, editor. So this block has around 1200 words. So it will come up with your heading. Like, so let's just have a quick read. Copywriting is a highly lucrative profession. It doesn't have the big bucks feel like it did earlier in the century when writers are respected celebrities and staff at school and colleagues, colleges offer courses in writing, but that doesn't mean it isn't money well spent. Copywriting is very similar to journalism in that you write about a subject, but instead of writing about a story, compelling information and offering solutions, you write solutions to problems. So I'm not going to read the whole thing. So they will come up with an introduction along with other H2s, H2 titles. So this one's marketing, got sales, professors, consulting, writing books, gift speeches. So it will show you a video. So I probably have forgot to turn this off. And then let's see what kind of, okay, I got just this slight typo, capital letters on the word. So they'll come up with all these different titles. And then the last one is blogging. So let's have a look at the SEO checklist. Since there's no feature images, the score will be lower. So Juice AI does both some of the words. They also do italics. I think that's some of the SEO scores they have. So we need to put it, we need to put up more images, feature images, and then meta description. So meta description, you can use like other AI tools. If you've got other AI tools, then probably use that to generate a meta description. But if you are just getting started and you have no other AI copywriting tools, I don't think Juice AI is the first one that you should be looking for. So there are plenty, there are plenty other tools out there. Like currently on AppSumo, I think it's Word Hero. That will be a good choice. Um, there's another one called shop here, but then AppSumo has no, has no more LTD on it. I think they've got other LTD site like, um, dealify that would have lifetime deals on, on shop here. So you can check those out. I'll leave a link down below. If you want, if you're interested, I've got some reviews on those as well. So back to juice AI. So if we are happy with this, then the, Jose, I can actually help you to integrate this with your, your WordPress. And if you have Shopify e-commerce stores, you can also integrate with that as well. So basically that's all there is for Juice AI. You come up with your keyword. It generates these titles for you. I mean, it generates these long tail keywords 
and then based on those long tail keywords, and it will help you generate an article. So sometimes it's within probably it, most of them are more than a thousand words, and you can't sort of change how many words or how many H2s there is for for your article. So there's less customizations on this platform. So let's see what else is available. So we'll click on articles. So we'll click on settings, have a look at the account. There are team plans based on the different subscription that you have. You might be a solopreneur, then you just need one account. But if you have a team and you need to generate a lot of content, then you probably need the, I think they call it the pro plan. I think they've been changing their plans quite a bit since, since uh, last November. So for those who got in early, the plans that you've purchased or subscribed does not exist on, on today's, uh, on their website. And I, I've heard, I've seen a lot of sort of, you no know, backslash on the, the early supporters on Juice AI. I think they are treasuring the early supporters. And I think they are giving probably more, more C words and then more articles per month as a way to sort of thank the, the existing or the early adopters. I think that's something it's the Juice AI team needs to work on is the, the communication between the early adopters and themselves. I think they're either, they're really busy working on the product and they're not focusing on the, on their Facebook communities, or I think it will be good that if they do some sort of like monthly Q and A that they can speak with their customers, their, their existing clients, what their needs. I think that would be a really good suggestion. I'm not sure if Juice AI team will see this video, but if I was one of the clients and I'm only seeing like a, a sort of a one way communication, I think having these sort of like monthly calls with your customers would be very valuable. So you can get like actual feedbacks real time. And I think inside the Facebook group, people are probably posting a lot of questions, but then they're being held as because you cannot post new comments without being approved. And I think there are a lot of questions on the Facebook group are not being answered. So either they only want to answer on through emails with their support channel and not on the Facebook, uh, not on the Facebook group. So I think the more transparency there is, there is on for Juice AI, the better it will be. So I think some of the content that I've generated in the past, some are actually quite good and it, it was really fast, but then there are some that wasn't too good. So it, it's a mixture feeling. And for me, if I was just getting started, I would not choose, I wouldn't choose Juice AI, but if I already have some other tools, but I'm missing like a, a really quick one click block generator tools, then Juice AI might be for you. So sometimes I will say it's hard to compare with like all the other AI, AI tools. If we're looking at the lifetime deal realm, all those other softwares like Word Hero, Creator AI, Katab, Niches, Shopia. I mean, there's, there's just, the long is just so long. And I think the way they want to stand up on their product is they have good SEO keyword search and then based on those keywords it helps you generate these articles and it can generate them pretty quick let's go back to the app sumo and let's look at their plans so on the tier one level you will get 40 articles per month that's a one user seat one new seed keywords per month so let's say the first month you put in your c word as for example ai copywriting ai copywriter then you have to wait for one month in order for you to put in another different keyword. But then the previous one that you've put in, Juice AI will continue to provide like any sort of new found keywords for you. So let's say I put in AI copywriter and if you search by date added, then you might be getting new ones from time to time. But they're not going to show you like with email notifications or in app notification. That's something you need to look for. And if they can, if they can create like a notifications telling you 
oh, I found three new keywords for you uh, this week or, you know, X amount of days. I think that'll be good. So you're only getting the tier one keyword explore. I think tier one is juicy. And if you want, if you want like all the tiers. Oh, sorry, my bad. Let me just correct myself. So tier one, two, three, I would, I would believe that tier one is juicy. Tier two is extra juicy and tier three is super juicy. So yeah, tier one, you'll get the juicy one. And then tier two, you'll get extra juicy. And if you stack up all the way to, to tier four, then you get the, you will get the super juicy. So in terms of, yeah, I think the pricing for the, the Z word will be, will be quite high. So depending like how many different niches you have, you can look into that. But if you, if you already have other keyword research tools, then you can just put in those words in here instead. Because the pricing will cramp ramp up pretty high. If you max out the tier, it'll be 360 lifetime purchase, three user seats. Every month you get five user, you get five new C words. So I would say if you're just doing it on your own, then probably tier two, you want to have at least two, two C words. One is just too limited and you all, you probably want those extra juicy, at least extra juicy to, to get your, those long tail keywords in here. But if you have already existing keyword search tools, then probably tier one that it really depends how many articles you're going to generate per month. And yeah, I think this is my sort of my honest review. If I have to say again, if this is your first AI writing tool you're considering juice AI is not going to be the first one. It shouldn't be the first one. You should get something as an all, all around with short form, long form, uh, copywriter. And then if you want to have these one click generation tools, then juice AI could be one of them. But again, there are a lot of different tools out there in the market. So you can, you can go into my video, you can go to my YouTube channel and have a look at some of my other reviews. I would say Juice AI would be very similar to a uh, question generator. So you can check out that one. So hopefully you found this video useful. It will help you make a better decision if you want to choose uh, Juice AI or not. I will leave a link down below if you want to give this a try. So this wraps up my quick review on Juice AI. It's a mixture feeling if it's good or not for for those who are looking for these one click block generator. And if you found this video useful, please leave it a like and subscribe to my channels for more of these AI copywriting tools or other AI softwares that I'm going to review in the future. So be sure to subscribe to my channel. I hope you have a good day and I'll see you in the next one.